Got a quick little video for today, and I just want to show you the best way to put on these little wire lugs, wire connectors, terminal connectors, really whatever you want to call them. I'm going to show you the best way to put them on there. So a couple things that you're going to need. You're going to need the little terminal end itself or wire lug itself. You're going to need some pliers or some way to pinch it and some wire uh, cutters and or wire strippers. You're going to need some solder. You're going to need some flux. You're going to need a soldering iron. You're going to need a lighter or a heat gun and some electrical heat shrink tubing. And usually this tubing comes in like, you can buy a set of it or you can buy specific lengths. And it comes in a long like, just cut it to the size you need. I cut it about an inch. First thing you're gonna do, so you gotta cut the wire. So we're just gonna go we'll cut off the end of it. Got a nice little clean end. Next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna go ahead and strip the wire. This has a wire stripping tool in it. There's a lot of ways to strip a wire. You can go ahead and use whatever way you want. And pretty much you only need to strip about this length right here at the end because this is the part that's only gonna be going over the wire. So we'll go ahead, place it in the jaws of the wire stripper, give a little pinch, we'll do a little circle. And I'm gonna go ahead and pull off the end of it. You can see I got the wire exposed now. Next thing, the most important thing, you're gonna take the heat shrink tubing, you're gonna put it on right now because there's been so many times where I've crimped this thing down and forgot to put the heat shrink tubing on. So always put it on before you crimp it down. Put the tubing on. Next, we're gonna put the little connector at the end right there. I'm gonna take my little pliers or my little crimpers. I'm gonna give it pretty much all the strength that I have and I'm gonna just really squeeze this down on there. You want this to be a very secure connection. Next thing is, I'm gonna take the flux that I have. It's a little bit of uh, liquid flux, I like it. Just give it a little drip drip, just like that. Next thing, I'm gonna grab the soldering iron and my solder, and I'm just gonna fill the tip with a nice little pool of solder. Just like that, just gonna keep it on there. I'm gonna grab the wire lug, and this part's pretty cool. I'm just going to, if I can get it to focus, I'm gonna hold it right there, I'm just gonna hold it. And that flux, you really need that flux, and if you watch, once it gets hot enough, it's just gonna get absorbed completely. Just like that, beautiful. Next, I'm gonna take the heat shrink tubing, I'm just gonna slide it up there. I'm gonna take the lighter, I'm gonna light it underneath it. Give it a little jiggle jiggle. Flip it over. And look at that, very nice. Super clean, super easy, you're gonna have perfect connections every time. 